Hello Aquarius, this is Crystal with We Are Magic. Welcome to January 2021. Aquarius, if you are new here, hello, I'm Crystal. And this channel is not just tarot, but more like waking up, you know, star seeds, light workers, middle pathers, the whole crew, the collective, into their truest, highest self. So, with that being said, we have fun with tarot also here. All right, because it's fun. So, with that being said, Aquarius, if you have not yet, please subscribe and click the notification bell so you can stay up to date on when I post videos. All right, so I'm tuning in to my I am presence, my highest self, and we're going to see what messages the universe has for you for January 2021. What can you expect? Right now, I'm clearing the energies from these cards. We got our dragon's blood incense burning, and we are ready to go. All right. Thank you, Spirit. This is for Aquarius, January 2021, and it doesn't want to shuffle anymore. They're ready. All right. What angel guidance do you have for quick? Let's, let's do it. You have blessings in abundance. I need one more spirit. <laughs> Blessings and abundance. Let's talk about Aquarius while we're here. This is the energy supporting you this month, Aquarius. Blessings and abundance. And you're like, yes, I'm here for it. Aquarius, if you've been going through a hard time dealing with this pandemic and you've been kind of trapped in here or maybe you've been out of work, are struggling financially or maybe you're struggling health wise this is a collective reading so this can go in your way what spirit is telling you is blessing abundance is for you in january 2021 so with that being said what spirit is saying is no matter what's going on around you aquarius don't watch the news for ignorance don't just turn that stuff off um talking to my mom right now turn it off She's an Aquarius. Um, that stuff is meant to keep your vibration so shitty. There's nothing wrong with staying up to date and current, current with the events. But when it's a whole soap opera and it's a whole drama, get rid of it. All right. Tune into your local news. See what's going on. Check the weather and dip out. I mean, get a book. Read a book. Meditate. Get out of your house. And if you're quarantined, you know, like I said, escape through a book. Um, sit outside in your yard. There are ways to raise that vibration so you can accept this blessings and abundance. All right. There is the law of attraction um, with universal law. You know, whatever is like unto itself is drawn. So if you stay in the mindset, Aquarius, of abundance and blessings, I'm highly favored. I am so loved. The universe loves me. God supports me. My angels protect me. Yes, that's the energy you want to be in Aquarius. Woo! You got this, guys. All right. Next angelic message for my Aquarians. My friend, Shaman Destiny Raven from SweetSpearLight.com here. And on a, she has a YouTube channel, Sweet Spirit Light. She gifted these cards to me, and I'm in absolute love with them. Absolute love with them. Ah, oh, powerful cards. I love them. Thank you, Destiny. Joy and contentment. Capricorn got this. So I see a theme going here with everybody. This should, I should have made this a collective reading. Anyway, stay in what I just told you. I just told you that this is where you need to be in. Joy and contentment. Stay in that energy of like, see her auric shield here? She has a golden auric shield all around her. Call in the light when you feel negative. Call in the light. What do you mean call in the light, Crystal? Okay, I'll tell you. Just read it in a book. It's amazing. Spiritual growth. Look it up. Um, what you do is you sit there and you call in your higher self. You invite your higher self to come and work with you. Okay. So you invite your higher self in first. And then what you do is I call in the light. That's all you have to say. And then you envision like a rain beautiful waterfall of golden white light coming down from the space plane from your highest frequency from heaven 
from that highest dimension down into your crown chakra, the top of your head. And it's going to enter all that energy is going to just start flowing through your body. It's going to go into your spine, down your spine, through your feet, which is your earth star chakra. It's going to hit every bone in your body. You're going to get anchored into mother earth. Okay. And then from there, you just keep envisioning this light because the light also from mother earth is also going to shoot up that same cord. And you're going to have all of this beautiful energetic light glowing through you. And instantly your vibration is going to raise. And that light, that healing source light, that God light energy, that creator energy is going to heal anything that is hurting you emotionally, physically. Just envision all of that light just building up into your whole body, Aquarius, until it spills out of your heart center, out of your eyes, ears, mouth, hands. These are energetic points also. And that you are, you have a whole force field around you. And you don't have to stop there. You can keep going now. You can take that light that's coming from you because you're so full of light yourself. So now it's excess, right? You take that excess light from source and say, hey, I want to share it with people. And you go ahead and you just push it all over your house and every crook and cranny and crevice and corner. And you just let it heal your home, your family. And then you have a protective shield over your house. Okay, we'll do baby steps. You don't got to heal the entire planet yet, Aquarius. I know some of you are already, but for the babies, let's work on us, okay? Let's work on yourselves first. All right, thank you, Spirit. So blessing and bindings are is the energy supporting you, and joy and contentment is supporting Aquarius for January 2021. Woo, Aquarius. Let's see what the month ahead has. Okay, that was cool. Thank you, Spirit. Okay. So energy the month brings for you guys is happiness, um, giving, um, giving back, um, the innocence of your childhood, that inner child inside of you that's wise, that's still there, Aquarius, that you tap into. Um, look at these two babies. The times when we were children and, you know, when we weren't paying bills and we thought life sucked then, <laughs> reflect back to that time. And you're like, oh, wait. It was pretty cool. Um, you know, when the most horrific thing that happened to you, if you weren't abused, of course, a lot of us were abused. But I'm just talking about as a child, an innocent child mind, you know, when they're like, hey, no, you got to come in for dinner. And you're like, but I'm playing and I want to go. I don't want to go without you. Yeah, I don't want to play. So, yeah, um, reflect back to the happy times of your life, Aquarius. This is the energy the month is bringing you. Your happiest time, the time when you had peace, the time when you were just giddy and joyful, joy and contentment. <laughs> joy and contentment, it's all I keep here. So, yes, that's beautiful. That's a beautiful energy that the month is bringing you. I mean, of course it would. All right, something we're going to move past from Aquarius. What are we moving past from? What is Aquarius moving past spirit? Okay. You're going to move past having been done wrong. Um, maybe you didn't get a promotion you deserved. Maybe you worked so hard at something and you wasn't rewarded for it. We're going to get past that. Okay. Um, you're also going to get past what I'm hearing is the entitlement that we all feel at times. Like, you know, I deserve to be rewarded. I deserve to be this, this, and that. We've got to get past that. And it's more about you. Yes, it's nice to be recognized. And yes, you know, you want to be like, oh, I want to be looked at like I'm the hero. Well, it's bigger than that because right now you have blessings, abundance, and joy and contentment from the universe pouring down on you guys. This is it. This is from the universe right here. This is the universe recognizing you. Who cares what people think? All right. Who cares what they think about you, Aquarius? Only person that matters is you. What do you think about you is all matters. And if it's in a prideful way, knock that out. 
which it shouldn't be because Aquarius, y'all are so sweet. But what I'm saying is some things didn't work out for you guys and it's okay because this month is bringing in some lovings. I'm so excited for you guys. Okay. What's benefiting them this month? What's benefiting Aquarius? The fool. There we go. So what's benefiting you this month is you are open. You are trusting. You are like, I'm not going to be rigid in my thinking because when is Aquarius ever like that? Aquarius is the total, hey, it is what it is. <laughs> I make y'all so happy. I'm so sorry. I just channel my mom a lot and my friend Destiny. It's just so funny. Y'all are just, oh my God, guys, this is you. Like, not that you're silly. People don't know tarot, doesn't understand. Let's not call you a fool. What they're saying is, hey, I'm open. It is what it is. Whatever the universe wants to give me, you want to give me blessings and abundance, I accept it. Joy and contentment, bring it over here. I'm here for it. This is a craze. <laughs> this is what's benefiting you this month. That, that openness, that expect the unexpected, that um, you want to hear my dog squeaking toys in the background. Just ignore them, please. Um, you're going... You guys are just so optimistic and that's the way you're supposed to be. Okay. Just, oh, guys, always winning. Aquarius, always winning. Okay. <sighs> I vibe off y'all so hard. It's not even funny. Spiritual growth this month. Ooh, yes. Meat and potatoes. Get it. Spiritual growth. What are we, what are we getting? What are we getting? I'm so excited for Aquarius. <sighs> Come on, Aquarius. Are you saying you have arrived in your spiritual growth? Not. You have not. No one has arrived. Get out of this, Aquarius, channeling people right now. No, no, no. There's always more. You'll never reach the rabbit hole, Bobo. Our job is to enjoy the ride and to grow and to help people. That Aquarian energy, that earth angel energy. You know what I mean? Oh, wow. Spiritual growth. Okay. Guys, you got some competition coming towards you. You got someone coming against y'all. And it may be energetically speaking, because where you guys are so blessed and abundant, you got some haters, and that's fine. Don't be mad about it. <laughs> Embrace that shit. You know what I'm saying, Aquarius? Um, competition, fighting, you know, watch your back this month, Aquarius. Um, it's, it's, it's in the spiritual growth. So what they're saying is you can't be an ego. You can't be like, you ain't going to talk to me like that. I'll whoop you like No, Aquarius, you're going to grow spiritually here. And that is, um, don't, everything's not a battle. Okay. Um, is it worth going to jail? That's spiritual growth. Someone jumps in your face. Someone tries to run you off the road. You send that shit straight to source. Let them handle it. That's what I do. And I know people think that's mean. I just don't have time for ignorance. Okay. You have anything coming against you. I suggest you put a shield of ore up right now because here they go barking. You have blessings and abundance coming to you. Hold on for a second. Hold on a second. Where is I'm back Aquarius. Okay. Sorry about that left bugs. Anyway. All right. So this is what we're going to do. Your spiritual growth. What spirit is telling me is that you have haters. Of course we all do. Um, you have a lot of competition. Um, just be mindful. Um, just stay in the moment of you are protected and supported by your angels and spirit guides and ancestors. Okay. All right. So now advice and encouragement for the month of January 2020, 21 for, okay. For Aquarius. Yes. You're building something. You're working on something Aquarius. The universe is recognizing it. Okay. Sorry. That's so blurry. Um, yes. Um, teamwork makes the dream work is what I just heard. <laughs> Um, guys work together with like-minded individuals. Okay. Um, your advice and encouragement this month is you guys are so extremely blessed. 
got to get out of that negative mindset though. There's some, not all of you are like this, but some of you are very focused on the negative of the current situation that's going on. And right now, you know, you're building a foundation. You're working on something. You are dedicated to something. Okay. I wish this camera, there we go. Well, you know what? It's still focusing on cutie pie right here. So that's why it's like, there we go. We got block cutie pie and it's not working. Anyway, um, you guys are just really committed and focused on something, something you're working on, building a foundational idea, a plan, you're planning, you're strategizing, and you're seeing the rewards of your efforts. And that is awesome. Aquarius, I love it. Okay, let's see if you have any more messages. Is there any other things you need to tell Aquarius spirit? Okay, yeah, yeah. You have been working very, very hard and spirit recognizes this, okay? Um, this, this is you with the world on your back, Aquarius. You are working your ass off for something and spirit is recognizing this so much. That's why you have blessings and, and abundance coming towards you. Okay, don't stop. Keep fighting. Be happy. Stay enjoying contentment. Only drama you got. You got some drama coming up this month, but you know what? Cancel, clear, release that shit. They can't touch you. Okay. All right, Aquarius. I love you, love you, love you so much. Thank you for hanging out with me. Have a very safe and happy January 2021. Keep that vibration high and stay grounded. I love you all so much.